Okay, welcome to another Orbiter 2010 video. This is going to be a very short video. It's just an explanation uh, to reply to somebody who emailed me a question. And that question was, how do you EVA when you're using the XR2 or XR5? And first of all, I'll point out that, that is com that's covered in the XR Flight Operations Manual. If you go to pages uh, 54 and down, then all the information that you need is in the manual. But if you have some uh, problem understanding that, then we can run through it really quickly here. If you're on Earth, uh, or I suppose in any oxygen-rich oxygen, oxygen -rich environment, but that would only be Earth and Orbiter, you simply need to just go to the upper panel, uh, turn on the APU, and actually let me set the time warp to 10 so we can get through this more quickly. And all you have to do is open the nose cone and open the outer door, and now you can EVA your crew. Egress successful. You can see we now have one person standing outside. If you're not on Earth, it's still easy, but there's one extra step that you have to do. Let's say that we are on uh, HAL base, for example, and we're obviously not in an oxygen-rich environment at this point, so let's jump inside the XR2, and let's do the same thing. Again, I'm going to set the time warp to 10. So turn on the APU, open the nose cone, and this time you have to pressurize the chamber. Depressurizing. Pressure then you can open the outer door. APU now you running. can EVA your crew. Successful. And you can see we now have uh, one person standing outside and we could EVA all of them if we wanted. Using Doing this in the XR5 is uh, not any more complicated. Let's jump into an XR5 that we have on Mars. Go to the upper panel. And again, let me set the time warp to 10. Tur uh, start the APU. And we're going to lower the elevator. And you'll notice there's this switch down here that says active EVA port, docking port, or crew elevator. You want to click that to switch it to crew elevator. And now you can EVA your crew. Egress successful. Now you can see one of our crew members down there at the bottom of the uh, at the bottom of the crew elevator. Hopefully that answers the question. If not, just go ahead and leave a comment to this video. And I will try to explain further in some other video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.